Hello, let's play a bunch of daily word games. Today's bonus game is Cell Tower. So let's start with Tower. All right, let's move that E on the left. Maybe end in E. Um, what do I want to do? <coughs> For some reason, I think thought of since, so why not? All right, uh, let's move the E again. Um, maybe in the middle? Is that, pl is that plausible? Seems like it. How about plead? All right, we got to move. Uh, let's look at this right word. We have almost all the letters. So P-O, P-O, and then is it like P-O-L-I or P-O-I-L? Honestly, I don't see a word. Uh, what's another option? P-O-I-L? I think I have to hold off on that because I can't think of it. Okay, so... E second, maybe E A, maybe it's D E A, um, or maybe like E like E A D Y. There's ready, but I don't see something else. Is like is B D a word with an E A? It'll accept it. I think it'll give me some info. It's probably not the answer though. Darn it. So what else goes there? Oh, heady. Yeah. Darn. That was a wasted guess. That B D. <coughs> Didn't help this. P O. Polyg, no, sorry, polyg, polyph, polyg, polym, like, polyp is a word, but not, not polyp. Um, what about, like, pommel, or poggle, or, I'm trying to even think, like, how this works. Pavel? Is it, is this obvious? P O I something L. I don't even know what would go between the I and the L. Is it a U? <laughs> um, P O L something I maybe. Polky? Is it multiple polkas? Is a polky? <laughs> or sorry, multiple polka. Multiple, a polka, the plural would be polky. Polkai. We dance multiple polkai. Anyway, it's not that. Uh, Poffly, pogly, pomly, poly with two L's. I am so stumped. I might just do a filler here. So let's do a filler that can do like I, L, L or something. Is there any way to get more more letters? Like I could do swill, right? But only tell me about the ILL. Um, I could do frill. Let's do quill. I don't know. P O L, and then there's an I somewhere over here. Polio. Didn't think about the repeating the O. All right. I had a much better solve yesterday. <laughs> Hetty and polio is tough, though. All right. Let's do fibble. So the way this game works is each guess has exactly one lie in the coloring. So now I can already tell you, Levy, the lie is in the E's, because this is not a possible coloring. If there was supposed to be a yellow E, it should have been the first one. So that means either there is no E's, or there's a green E at the end, or there's two E's. And this one is yellow or green, or this one is green. So either way, the L and the V are not in the word. So I think I want to do a double E word. So I think I'll do an EE -E like this and test that if I can. Um, I'm sure I can think of something. Um, is there a good word I can think of, though? Another option would be EE -E here. That would actually work, too. Um, why doesn't it like that? Three lies. Three lies. Oh, right, 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 right. This one has to be a color in some way. Yeah. This is the lie. Because if this was telling the truth... Oh, the, oh no. The only way this tells the truth is if this is also the lie. 
Otherwise, this has to be lying. So I think this can't be lying. Because if this was the lie, what color would it be? If it was green, this should have been yellow. If it's yellow, this should have been yellow, right? So this is actually telling the truth. Um, so I would need to do E. Maybe I could I could do E E like this, but otherwise, um, I could start with double E as well. But I can't do three E's because then I would need two lies in Levy. All right, I figured it out. It has to be this if we use double E, and I need to come up with a word. Why is it so hard? We have all the letters. I suppose there's wheezy. Wait, why doesn't it like wheezy? Shouldn't it just be that this E is lying as green? Oh, but then this would have to be yellow. Oh, hold on. I think my only option is to have all of these E's gray. Because... In order for this to be yellow, both of these E's need to be some color. Yeah, okay, that's interesting. Okay, we just don't have an E. Or we could end an E. I, I could do word ending an E. That would be fine. That'll be very easy. Let's do rouse. Okay, well, these disagree. Um, let's keep using E at the end, maybe? I'd have to do something like this. Um, is that a word? I'm thinking about throwing out the E. Um... I'd, I'd love to not, though. Is there something like are you forum? Okay, so one of these O's is lying, which means we, that anything that agrees between rouse and forum has to be true. So these both agree that there's no R in the word. Uh, these both agree there is a U in the word, but we don't know if maybe one of them's lying and should have been green. So we can't mark them totally correct, but we know there's a U in the word. Um, so I'm thinking about using, um, what am I thinking? Maybe an OU like this and then new letters. Um, I thought about, thought of proud, but there's no R. Um, it's gotta be something really. There's no L or R, which makes it harder. Uh, about. About works. Wow, that was it. Nice. Levy confused me. And it's because I, I haven't really encountered this situation before. That was new to me. That was neat. Um, but also confusing. <laughs> yeah, because the only two situations were either no E's in the word at all, or this had, uh, this had to be lying as green. Because as soon as this E was lying, this yellow should have moved to this E. Um, these Both of these E's needed a color in order for this E to get a color at all, unless it was green. So this E had to be the lie. That's really interesting. I never thought about that before, but that's definitely true. Cool. And I got it in uh, three guesses. Nice. All right, let's do between all. Um, I'm going to go back to starting with mouse. I feel like that's been working better for me. We're pretty close to mouse, 14% away. So I think um, I'm going to jump all the way down to house. I think it might be too far, though. Not not really. Like, that's pretty close. Uh, do we start with H or I? Can I do, like, a really late H? Um, I could do human. Is that late enough? Apparently not. Okay, I think I have to jump to I then. Let's do igloo. It's the first I word I thought of. Okay, igloo, very close. Um, what's like a good word starting with I near igloo? Um, I mean, I could guess something like idols, but I've never seen a plural be the answer. Um, how about idyll? Ooh, I have to actually go farther. There aren't that many I words. Um, there's about eight words between our word and idol. It could it be a really late H word? Like I could do hymen. Not on the word list. Oh, okay. Oh, it's E-N then, right? Yeah. No, yeah. It's got to start with an I. Uh, maybe, maybe icily. Too far. Okay. So between C and D, can you do a really late C? A really early D? Like, I don't know. I have maybe idler. 
idled. Not far enough. It's hard. Okay. ID. Four words, huh? I don't see how we're doing IDK or IDJ. IDI? Doesn't make a lot of sense. Could it still be IDL? I don't see how. Um, how far back are we going? IDE? Could it be IDD even? I can't think of any words. I could I could try ideas just to get an idea of where we are here. It's like right before. Oh, it's ideal. Darn! If I thought for two more seconds. Okay. Oh well, I got it. Ten guesses. That's a lot. All right. Well, how'd you do today? All right. Let's play Cell Tower. So the way this game works is we need to create words using every single letter. The words are 48 letters long. There's only one solution, which means you can't just lock in any old word. You need to lock in words such that it doesn't break the ability for everything around it to also make words. Now, it's not your typical word search style. So the words do have to be connected, but the way it works is you can draw something like this, right? And it's read left to right, top to bottom. So this is V-O-I-I-B-R-O, -I -I which is not a word, but that is how the game works. Um. <coughs> okay, so this V is obviously going to the O because it can't go straight to the B. And I am seeing voice. Um, and then we have both. I don't see bother. So we could do voice and both. Um, I see top. No, I don't see. I thought I saw topsy, but I don't. Can voice be extended is kind of the question I'm thinking about, whether I want to lock it in or extend it. Let's hold on to voice for a second. What are we doing around it? So we could do both. Um, and then what, what would be happening over here? I-N-S-E or something. Um, you see, this isn't actually rinse because it would be read I-N-S-E and then R, and it wouldn't actually be connected, so we'd have to get the I as well. Um, so that doesn't really work. Uh, in something? Insist. I can't do insist. How about inset? We have inset. I've got riser or something. Riser? I feel like I'm kind of locking myself out of this NT though. Uh, net or something? Net is too short, but maybe there's some way to extend that. I'm not seeing it. Um, I think something might be wrong already. Let's clear all this out. Um, so voice, I said inset. Can I do incentive? Hold on. Insen, there's no V. I have entire here. Entirely. Okay, that looks, that looks good. Oh, I can do insist, actually. I'm, I'm going to lock in entirely. That looks good. All right. And then we have insist. Insisted. That looks really good, too. Um, I see replay. Oh, re. I thought I saw, like, replace or something. But no. Um, I like insisted, though. Let's lock that in. I can always remove it, but to get a perfect score, you can't lock in something and then remove it. It counts against you. But it's not a big deal. Um, but also locking it in can get you can be very confusing if you locked in the wrong word. Uh, I still see voice here. What's this R E G R doing? Um, I do see both still. So if I did voice and both, relegate? No, rel re regret. I do see regret. But then what's this L doing? Leg or something? Legs? I mean, I see legs. And then play PLA something. Or PLEA even. This double C is confusing. So what's this TOP doing? Do 
just topic and cycle. Just plea. This is looking okay. So I'm I'm at least gonna I'm gonna lock in voice. I'm gonna lock in regret. I don't see any like regrets or regret. Yeah, okay. Um, both and topic. You can't do like topical or anything, right? Okay, topic, and then what was this one? Just legs, I think. And then we had cycle. So I'm not going to lock in cycle and plea yet, just in case, because um, I'm less confident about that. We do have what? Um, I see sale. No, that's not sale. That would be S A E L. What's this S doing? Oh no, topics. I think I think topic takes one of these S's. Probably this one because we can't do S R or S D. Oh no. Okay. So I think I need to remove topic and put in topics. I don't know which S to take though, so I can't actually even use that yet. Um. Let's see. I had I had all this plea, cycle, topic. One of these S's is used by topic. Um. I'm not sure which one's better. Probably this one, right? Because we can't use this S otherwise. Just dies? Something feels wrong. Um, I see T-I-O-N-S. Rotations or something? No. Um... I can add three letters to it because the max is eight letters. So if I do shuns, I can add three letters at the start. Options. I like that. Okay. Um, what's this S doing? What's this R doing? These A's got to get split up. They have to split up. Any, anybody? Is it does it consider anybody one word? It does. So we had options, anybody, topics, cycle, plea, what, maybe dies. Let's hold off on dies. Um Sarel Carm Carmen. Hmm, what's going on with this? Alarm? Okay, we have alarm. I'm worried about this SRE here. Um, if topics took that S, it still doesn't really help. Um, can, can, oh, maybe it's cycles. C Y C L E S. Cycles. Red. Oh, I think I did options with two T's, which is bad, but we can now do recent and dies. Okay, so that's what it is. So we've got topics using this one, and we've got cycles using this one. Plea is filled in. We got what. We have anybody. We have options like this. We have alarm. We have recent, and we have dies. Nice. All right. So you can see that in this, it's not a straight line because it said at this point I made a mistake. Then I did another word after making that mistake, and then I undid the mistake. Uh, and so it's not a, quite a perfect game, but it's fine. So cool. We had some good words today. Um, I liked entirely. Finding that actually got me kind of broken into the puzzle. And getting insisted was nice too. Um, these S's were nasty, topics and cycles. I I should have thought about how they could be pluralized and there were S's nearby. Um, that was just a mistake. But yeah, cool. How'd you do? All right, let's do polygonal. It's an eight letter word today. This repeats and there should be one more. Yeah, this repeats and this repeats. And otherwise we have unique letters. So six unique letters total. If I did ING, what's that look like? It starts with IG. I'm not a huge fan of that. 
We could do ignoring though. Must match the pattern. What else repeats? Oh, uh, uh. Oh, the N. The N repeating is bad. Um. Ign. Oh, I, I, I feel like starting with ig, we want to put an N after it. Iglooing. No, I can't even repeat the O. Okay. So I don't like ing. Um. What if this was a. I was going to say S, but. Maybe, maybe second letter likes to be R or L. So we could end in ER. And then this could be something like T, because I like the TR and I like ending in TER. So something like traitor, but we need one more letter. Tra. What? What? Oh, sorry. TR. Tract. I need three letters there. How am I doing that? Trait. I feel like it would have to be something like this. I've heard of a, uh, a, a janitor. Have you heard of a tranitor? Um, darn, I'm not really seeing how to fill three letters here. This might be one of those patterns I have to do a filler for. In fact, I am, I'm going to do that. So let's just do machine to see if I'm right about some of this stuff. All right, I was on the wrong track. Um, with ER. A and I. All right, I'm going to just go straight to robustly because I don't think I have enough. All right, so this is an S in the middle of the word somewhere. Um, this is not A or O. Let's see, how many? We have one, two, three, four. We have five of our six letters. Um, could this be an A? I'm trying to think what goes after S. It could be like a P or something, but the second letter is not A or O. So I kind of like starting with A, just so that we can do like an N or something here. Um, maybe it would be A-I-N or A-O-N. O-A would make more sense. This is not this is not becoming a word. <laughs> Anno something, yeah, it's, it's no good. Um, do I need another filler? Like this is confusing. This is not an N. I think I still like A there, but it's confusing. Um, this can't be the O. This could be an I, but that's a bit strange, isn't it? What if we did I N in the beginning? I N. That's that's looking okay. We do I O N. Yeah, in invasion. Nice. Okay, figured it out. <laughs> that was tough, even with Robosu machined. Okay. Uh, was I right? There were 10 ordinary words I could have found. Armchair, asteroid, any of them with like good suffixes? No, there weren't. So that's why I was having trouble. No good suffixes. The T-I-O-N suffix is obviously a good one, or S-I-O-N, but I didn't really think about that. Cool. Well, let's do the mini. Oh, well, that's interesting. Uh, what even does that? Mama? Is that, is that the only word? Papa, too, right? Uh, mama and Nana, that's it. Okay, Papa's one P. Well, two Ps. But you know what I mean. Mama and Nana. Nice. One of 50-50. <laughs> nice and easy. All right, let's do symbol. I'll start with blaze. L might be second. Let's check that with sling. L is not second, so let's try uh, E second, maybe. Um, what could I do there? Um, think about petty. I don't know why. I just kind of want to do it. Ends in Y. So it's an, it's an A-Y word. Of course it is. Um, what's a good, what's a good A-Y word? Maybe Harry? It is a Y. I mean, I was basically down to that. Um, otherwise, that means there would be a B or a Z second, which I, I was. I would not think that would be true. So it's not A R or Y. Um, is there something better I can guess here? Like <laughs> Daddy? <laughs> Darn. Oh, didn't expect that. Is it like Caddy or something? It is. Wow. 
that he worked out. All right, cool. All right, well, let's move on. Let's do the blind fusel. All right, our first guess we can't use BGK, TV, or X. So let's do. Um. Um. Let's do noisy. Nothing from noisy. Okay. This one we're gonna get symbol-like yellows. They're gonna show up blue if we get any. Um. Let's try tread. Oh, you know what? Let's let's do let's do um asylums follow up hot or hot however you say that. Oh, we got lots of blues. Okay, so that means that in the first slot we have an A U T or E. In the second slot we have an H U T or E, and in the fourth slot we have a H A U or E. So I'm thinking about trying an E R word here. That puts the E in that fourth slot, and then um maybe maybe a T U. We could we could try tuber. There's going to be a lie here, which is going to complicate things. All right. I am thinking, what am I thinking? Um, <coughs> oh, no. I don't know what the lie is. So I want to try the T and the E here again. I think I want to see if the R is the lie. But that would mean we'd need a U there, which doesn't make any sense, because that would have got been green in, in hook. OK, so that's no good. I think the R has to be the lie. And I think, well, that means that. No, that doesn't work. So, okay, as is, this U has to be the lie. Because we know the U is in the... If there is a U, it's in the first, second, or fourth spot. Oh, I guess the T or E could be the lie. So that means that the R is not lying. So maybe we're... T oh, no, but then R, R could only go here otherwise, if the R is not a lie. Because it can't go in any of the blues. Because the blues are from a, a hot... <coughs> And then if the U is not lying, then it goes first or fourth. And then whatever would go there would be lying. Um, and then otherwise, the U could be lying. <coughs> oh my gosh. I even have cough drop. Give myself a second here. I don't know what's going on with this lie. Because um, the U could be lying as gray. You know, the U could be lying as green, too. Is there a T-U-R-E something? That would be perfect. But I don't see the word. It's temp... You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to guess truer. We're only going to get greens on this guess anyway, and I can't think of the word, so let's just do this. All right, so the T and the E were not lying. The R... Could still be here, unfortunately. Um, okay, so I'm going to try the R here. I'm going to try the U here, just to see if the U was lying. Um, and then I'm going to get some new letters. Um, maybe get an... I could I could put an A here, just to see if the A was... Sp no, we okay, we know there's no A, because it would have to end up in one of those two. This letter is a U. This letter is a U. The U is the lie. So I think this UR will end up green, but let's confirm that. And so it would be T-U-R-E. I don't know. Let's try L or P or um, maybe, I don't know. It can't be an A. I don't know, an M? I don't know. I don't know what we're looking for here. Oh, the U. Hold on. The U. There's no U in the word. That's an H. Oh no. I thought only three worked there. What? What else goes here? I didn't think about how it could just be TH. That that was my mistake. But what what the heck goes here? Q W through. Oh, yeah. Okay. Almost through it. <laughs> Didn't, though. Okay. Murple. Yeah, I didn't consider the case of the U lying should have been gray, and then the H goes there. And had I thought of that, I would have been like, oh yeah, T-H-R-E, and I would have had 
three probably guessed here, and then these would have all been green, and then I would have been eventually figured out through. All right. Well, let's move on. Let's do Don't Wordle. It's thinking of a secret word. We are trying not to guess it. So we have an A, not second, not fourth, a single A. So let's put it in the middle, see if we can um, not use another vowel yet. What would be a good word to do there, though? Oh, pizzazz. Forgot that I had a follow up there. Interesting. So we start or end with A. Um, what should I do? It's something to do at all. I know L and T are really common, but it only introduces one more O and it does double up the L. So let's do that. Well then, okay. So we might be at the point where I just have to figure out what the word is and undo, but we'll see. Um, this game has five undos, which is very generous. But you can't undo if you accidentally guess the word. If you accidentally wordle, you're, you're done. Um, you can't undo that. So we have to figure out what the word is without accidentally guessing it. Um, there can't be two A's, otherwise I would say aroma was possible, but it's not actually. Um, what if I try a double O word? Like... I don't actually know what would do that. I thought there would be something. A ruse? It might accept a ruse. Darn. Like multiple uh, multiple sounds dogs make. <laughs> a roo! Um, I feel like it should accept a ruse. Um... I'm a cook. <laughs> there might not be a word. Annoy is two ends. I was thinking about a noise, but obviously that doesn't work. Um, I could try an OU word. About, but there's no T. This is hard. There's only 35 words. You think I... Okay, I see a Dorn. Do I gamble on a Dorn? Let's see if anything else like a born is accepted or a acorn. Acorn is another actually real word. A morn, a forn, a worn, a sorn, a vorn. No, maybe not. All right, I'm gonna. I'll, I'll gamble on acorn then. I mean, it's a gamble. Phew. Okay, it wasn't any of that. Um, back to the drawing board. It's not a foot. No T. Um, oh, I? How about adobo? Is that a word? Ad adobe. Ad let's try adobo. Okay. You know what? I might, I might be able to just win. I uh, just have to come up with something. Maybe, can I come up with a plural? I saved the S for that reason, just in case. Um... How about ahoys? Multi multi multiple ahoy. <laughs> no? Okay. Um, darn. I thought that would work, actually. <laughs> um, gotta be more creative, I guess. Ahoys. Oh. Atoms, but we can't use the T. Um, I, I was thinking about MS. Ending in MS, not the disease. Um, I don't think there's another word for this. I know there's words, and including the word that it is that I still haven't figured out. Um, OU. Is there like an OES word? Like, but let's just try them. A woes, a yos, a sos, a foes, a goes, a hoes, a coes, axos, a vos, amos. No. How about a woms, aoms, aoms, a psalms, foms. There may not be a plural left, which would be very unfortunate. Axums. Moms. 
No. So what, what are we doing? We can't actually do double O. It really feels like an OU is the way to go here, but I don't actually see a word, including the word it's supposed to be. Could it be like O S Y? Like what's going on here? Whoa. Sorry about that. Whoa. Just trying to adjust my chair here. <laughs> Get more comfortable. Um What about ending an E? Like a tone, right? But there's no T or N. But something. Um. I'm trying to think like what, oh, a woke. A woke is probably the answer. Let's try all the other letters for A-W-O. This is kind of my strategy for hunting other words. It's ones that are close to ones that are that I know are words. Skip to K, skip to K, okay. A wove, a wom. Okay, and then we'll try um with the K there. I already skipped a W, so we should be okay. Oh, a gok. This doesn't look promising though, does it? Evoke. Evoke is a word. Evoke. No. So that, that strategy didn't work, but I think the answer is awoke. Um, darn. Uh, what do we do? What about if, what if I end in I? I don't really want to go through all those words. I feel like this is how this game has been ending recently. <laughs> Just trying to fish out the weird words that are left. Well, I know it's awoke. How far do I have to go back? I'm not even sure. Give me end in double S. Let's try them all. A loss, yas, sauce, a boss. All right. I don't. I don't know. Um. Like was, it's not like there was a lot that I wanted to guess that suddenly I couldn't, but like, I feel like Adobo is a much better guess for the third guess than this one because it didn't use up very much. And I now know that it's safe to use the S. Um, okay, let's go back. Let's use Adobo here. Maybe I shouldn't have used the O at all. Lucky in that O there. Why would I do that? All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna do that. Um, let's just not use the O. So something like abyss is fine. I don't have to save the S anymore. Um, what what do I do now? Um, a muck maybe. Oh, I don't have to use the K. Darn it! What am I? I'm just trying to get through this. I'm I'm basically over it. Um. Yeah, let's undo. I have one more undo. Let's just undo a muck. Let's not let's not introduce word letters that we know are in the word, unless we have to. Um, we know there's an e in the word and an o in the word. We can use u and i just fine. Um, so a miss would have been fine, but we we used up the s. That's fine. Um, something like a tire might be okay because we know we're gonna get that green e. But can we hold off on that for one one more? Um, Something like A A U and then like another U or I don't know. Um, 
aglet wouldn't be terrible but again I, I, that l and t are in high demand um is there like an acc word i could do or an ax word even ax i, I don't i don't know what would be ax What about like an A and then ING word? Axing is a word, actually. Okay. I was thinking about an AE word. What was it? Um, I don't know. What should I do? I could do a vert. Introduces the E as yellow. I have no more undos, so I gotta be careful. What am I doing after a vert? I'd have to use the E. Can't use the RTV. Um I don't know if I like that. It's too many good letters. I could do an ER word, maybe. I don't mind introducing the E this late. Um, is our good ER word, though. <coughs> Adder. Okay, I should be okay now. Um, just avoid a woke. Um, think about ending an E. Why is this so hard? Um, how about a cute? There we go. And it was a woke. I don't know what else was possible earlier. Probably nothing useful. <laughs> Could I have done a move? Maybe. I might have been able to do a move. I don't remember if I had the V used or not. What were my... It doesn't show me my undos anymore. All right, it doesn't matter. Well, those are the games for today. Hope you enjoyed them. If you did, then why not leave a like, subscribe, and a kind comment below.